all right guys so let's talk about a new series that i'm getting ready to put out what do you say we ride down the road and dive into it guys welcome back to rolling with t-bone as we're rolling down the road on the diablo at half the speed we need if you're new here welcome in my name's t-bone i shoot motorcycle related content any kind of content really if you're old here welcome back you know what's going on man i'll tell you guys beautiful weather for the next few days every day has a little sunshine on it according to my cell phone now i'm not sure how much faith we can put in that but for now it's beautiful but all right guys uh i've been telling you guys the last couple of episodes of rolling with t-bone that i have been working on in my mind doing a couple of series video series and i'm going to start the series will be next the next time you see rolling with t-bone after this video now what i've got in mind to do is i'm just going to ride do riding me for uh videos you know there's no thing in the rule book that says i have to actually talk every time i ride the motorcycle so what i'm going to do is i'm going to pick out roads and i'm going to ride them you guys, I'll try to arrange my microphone where you just can hear the motorcycle, hear nature as I'm riding. But uh, R1 immediately said, uh, okay, but you can't quit doing your talking videos because I don't think the people would like that. So of course not. I'm not going to quit doing my talking videos. But not every video has to be a talking video. If I've got something to tell you guys, something to update you guys, I can still do that still do these type of videos i'm doing right now but the series that i'm wanting to shoot they'll be shorter videos they won't be 18 22 minutes 27 minutes long uh according the episode will be just according to how long the ride is on the road that i picked out uh i'm wanting to do most of them on diablo diablo is just a fun back roads bike to ride uh, of course i'm not going to be doing nothing crazy and all that i just I've been watching videos where there's not a lot of talking from the guy riding the bike. Of course, he might say something here and there. But he's kind of in the moment riding the road, enjoying the ride, letting us enjoy the sound of his motorcycle as he rides. You know, some of his videos are two and a half minutes long because he goes down a real short road. Some of them are, you know, eight to ten minutes long. Again, it's just according to how long the road is as to how long the video will be. But it's just something uh, something else I want to evolve into with uh, rolling my T-bone. Like I said, there's nothing in the rule book because really there is no rule book on moto vlogging on what we're doing here. Uh, so there's nothing to say that every time I turn this camera on that I have to have a full monologue available for you guys to listen to while we're riding. Sometimes it just, uh, just be fun riding, just enjoying the ride enjoying being on a bike uh, so I'm gonna probably start that series it'll either be the next video or the next one after that it's just according because I do have a couple of bikes that I'm wanting to ride and review so it'll just be according to when I can actually fit them in as to when the series will start but I'm actually looking forward to it guys it's uh these kind of videos that I want to shoot that's just riding the road it takes some of the pressure off of me to carry on the conversation all the ways because I'll tell you something guys there's a lot of times that I ride that I really don't have nothing to talk about and I know those are kind of stale videos but that's one of the series that I'm wanting to do and there's another one that I'm not sure how I'm going to do it uh I'm not even sure if it's going to happen this year, but I've been wanting to do uh, a rolling with T-Bone episodes where I visit haunted places like the Chastain House, uh, Tilly Bend Cemetery, 
other haunted areas in our area that I can actually ride to and uh, kind of check them out and review them and let you guys go along with me. Uh, so I'm, I may, I may try to shoot one or two of those as test videos this year. Uh, again, I'm not certain that I'm going to. It's just something that I've got rolling around in my head because I'm still kind of limited on time. Which is another thing shooting just these riding videos where I'm riding the roads will also benefit me a lot more too. Uh, because I can just get on the road and ride. And, you know, a lot of my favorite roads around Fannin County are not far from my home. So, like that road we just came off of there. That's one of my favorite roads to ride. I usually, y'all probably seen it. I do a lot of that in my videos. some of that too <laughs> so, <laughs> oh, I love this little motorcycle guy I ain't gonna lie to you but you guys let me know uh, kind of what y'all think I mean do, do y'all know of some places that I could go to like I said maybe haunted places in our area that uh, maybe I have forgotten about uh, I know of the Chastain house I know of, uh, like I said, Tilly Bend Cemetery. The entire River Road, for years I have heard, is haunted. Uh, for years I always heard about uh, a girl who was a hitchhiker, I guess for the lack of a better word. A ghost <laughs> that would jump in the car and ride with you. Uh, never had that happen to me and I used to go up and down the river road quite a bit I worked in Dalton at the carpet mill for a while and we used to cruise it all the time going to Cleveland and Chattanooga to cruise and if you don't know what cruising is you might be a little bit young on the channel so you just google it and it'll tell you exactly what cruising is you'll find out all you old school folks in here watching you'll know what cruising is because it, it was essentially how our teenage years were spent there's whole movies made about it. Uh, American Graffiti, <laughs> being the one that comes straight to the top of my mind, American Graffiti. Uh, cruising been around. I, I don't know if they still cruise. Of course, I aged out of the cruising. Uh, but I, I don't think it's as big a thing as it used to be. I think the law kind of cracked down on people who cruised whatever reason I never saw a problem with cruising if you were you know going into the stores buying drinks and candy and snacks and gas and you know if you were patronizing the businesses in the place where you were cruising I never saw a problem with it but <coughs> that's just me but uh, I got some comment I got a comment on my last video I'm gonna let Chris know uh, yes Amityville Horror he actually gave me three or four real good movie suggestions to review. So, as we get closer to Halloween, I will be doing some movie reviews. And those probably won't just pop up on a Monday. They may just be random. They may just pop up any time during the week. Whenever I can shoot it and get it edited, I may just, the day I edit it, so I don't end up with a bunch of <coughs> footage that I don't need. Uh, the day that I shoot, I'll try, I may just try to edit and upload that day. Uh, so I got to figure out what to call the series, of course. Last year, before I uh, changed the name of this to Rolling with T-Bone, used to be T-Bone Southern Ride, and of course we had the rocking, shocking October of Motos of Mayhem. I noticed on my YouTube page, I am getting a few views, and I haven't checked my Facebook page, but if you haven't checked those out, Go back and check those out. Give them a give them a watch. I review a lot of a lot of cool movies last October, but that's kind of what's going on, guys. I just wanted to share that with you. The the ride series that I'm going to be doing it'll probably be I'll probably call it. I, I don't know what I'll call the series. Probably V riding on X Highway or something like that. I don't know. I'm going to be doing it on Diablo. I'm hoping mostly on Diablo. 
I may use the blue moon I may use big papa because I was going back through my footage from the last several videos I made it has been a while since big papa has made an appearance on rolling with t-ball actually it's been a while while since big papa has made a uh, appearance on rolling with t-ball so it may be time to it may be time to bring big papa out on this new series big papa may be the one that gets to gets to usher in a new series on rolling with t-bone but we'll see but i just wanted to share that with you guys real quick and just let you know what was going on if you watch a video of mine you don't hear me talking you'll know what's going on but i'll tell you what guys i'm going to jump off here and uh enjoy the rest of this little ride that i'm on so I'll tell you what, guys, until the next time, y'all take care of yourselves and each other. I'm T-Bone, and you have been watching Rolling with T-Bone.